let's go through the basics of running a SEMrush site health check as knowing this information is going to help you find issues with technical SEO on your website and get those fixed so that you have a higher chance of ranking at the top of the search results for various different terms. Now, if you don't already have a SEMrush account, I'll leave a link below where you can get signed up for a trial and you can test all this stuff out. But once you get signed into your account, you'll see on the left side here under SEO, there's a site audit. If you click that, it's going to bring you to a page where you can create a project. So just put your domain name in here, give the project a name. It's going to ask you a couple of different things. Once you've gone through and done that, it's going to scan your website, which can take a little bit of time. And then that's going to give you a report. It's going to have an initial score here where it's saying, you know, you're at 73 or whatever yours is, and you should be at like 92. So this is just a quick site health check um, score, which has to do with a bunch of different errors and warnings and notices and whatnot. And then we have a further breakdown here of you know, different things like it looks like we need some help on the markup and the internal linking, but a number of these are doing quite well. And so we can go through and find where there are errors, like there are some 400 errors. And we can open these up one by one and start addressing these. So it looks like some links have probably changed over time and there are some pages that are, or links that are showing 400 errors. We can view these in more detail, maybe. Oh, I'm hiding the results on accident. <sighs> if you accidentally hide them like I did, you can come here <laughs> and unhide them. Uh, but it, that's just so that if you fix something, um, you can hide the error after it's done. But we should be able to check these in more detail. There we go. So this shows us what page the broken link is on and the broken link URL. So it looks like this is uh, um, on some page that's linking to a, a, a link that doesn't exist, essentially. So of course we'd want to fix that. Um, and then there's some invalid structured data items. We'd want to come through and check these, see what's going on with these. Looks like there's supposed to be an address, but it's not showing. Now I'm not going to go into all the details about all these different issues, but if you click view in more detail, it will show you in detail what all these issues are, how things have changed over time. And then you can just start going through and fixing each of these issues until you have everything positioned to where it's, you know, 92 to 99 or 100%. And then your score will go up here. It will be in, you know, in alignment with what Google and other search engines are wanting to see from a technical SEO standpoint which will ultimately just help boost your rankings, drive more traffic and sales and all that good stuff. So I hope you found this helpful. If there's anything you did have questions about in terms of how to run a SEMrush site health check or anything like that, don't hesitate to reach out. You can just drop your questions in the comment section below and I'll be sure to get back to them there. If you're like most new business owners, you're probably struggling to get your online presence established, let alone get it to the point where it's bringing you a consistent flow of customers, right? So that's why I created this free course where I actually walk you step by step through the whole process of setting up your online presence. This is the same process we've been using for our clients for over a decade and one of my agencies. And essentially, I'm going to show you how to set up an SEO-friendly business name right from the get-go, how to develop your website really quickly and easily, how to set up your Google Maps listing, start getting some Google reviews, everything you need in order to have a substantial online presence where people can actually start finding you and, and purchasing your products or services. <laughs> Best part is, I'm going to show you how to do it in under a couple of hours, and all for less than 50 bucks. 
If you're interested, I'll leave a link below where you can get signed up today. Make sure to check this course out for free right now because I'm probably going to start charging for this at some point in the future. All right, I'll see you on the other side.